local gen, Hartford Hospital is expecting a shipment of that Johnson and Johnson vaccine here tomorrow morning at 1030 AM. But my charts is just one of the sites people have expressed difficulty using to book a vaccine appointment as frustrations continue. On the Fox 61 Facebook page, we asked viewers to share their experiences signing up for a COVID-19 vaccine. The post receiving more than 650 comments, and many say they're still frustrated. Governor Lamont says more appointments will become available this week. But what happens if you're still running into technical issues online using sites like VAMS? The problem is similar to you know driving from New York to New York, London or something like that on I-95. You never know where the bottleneck's going to be. Cybersecurity and engineering expert Fred Scholl explains web developers know how to build successful e-commerce websites, which are what vaccine scheduling sites are, but it's difficult to engineer in a short time frame. So you've got a bottleneck on the web server itself. You've got a bottleneck on the logic that's matching your request up to the uh, you know available appointments and then you've got another bottleneck to the database where all that data is stored and it's really hard to make these sites scale up. Although many are encountering issues, some people have been successful scheduling a shot. Around 625 I was getting ready to leave and to go somewhere and all of a sudden the phone rang I'm going wait a minute, what's this? Picked it out of my pocket and it said COVID. I said what? COVID? I'm going to answer this one. And the lady goes, yeah, I'm from uh, Waterbury Hospital. I want to schedule an appointment for COVID. I said, are you kidding me? And if you're looking for some help, you may be able to turn to Vaccine Angels. It's a Facebook group with more than 7,000 members dedicated to helping individuals in Connecticut and New York schedule vaccine appointments. Anybody can come into our Facebook group and within a matter of seconds, if not minutes, be received by one of our moderators that will explain to them where they can go to secure a vaccination shot and or secure excess vaccine. And Governor Lamont says residents looking to secure a vaccine appointment should continue attempts as more appointment slots should be opening up throughout the week. We're live in Hartford tonight. Zania Maldonado, Fox 61 News.